we fire for. 59 year old David John Williams was given his final farewell today. A former Trinidad and Tobago Football Association president, W Connection Football Club owner, and businessman, among several other hats worn publicly. But it was in his family his heart was rooted. Still, however, it was that larger than life public image that would be most remembered. David had the ability, not gifted to many, to have a creative vision, a dream, and transform it into reality. He took the brand of a fat match playing sports club and created the most decorated local professional football club in over 20 years. At the helm of W Connection FC, he shot into the national spotlight. When you speak professional football, you can't say it without saying W Connection, you know, and so that alone will speak for itself. As he led the club, that professionalism and a domineering will to get it done would come to define his management style at the reins of power within the TTFA. He was a guy who would just call you when he had an idea and make sure that you understood and whether you liked it or not, it was going to get done. This purpose-driven man, when he had an idea or was given an assignment, he was all in, 100%, with energy and vigor that made it difficult for most of us to keep up with. He was meticulous and resolute. By the way, that's another word for stubborn. Boy, was he stubborn. But he was stubborn in his purpose if he felt what he was doing was right and would benefit others. As for his lasting legacy, only one thing rang out. The drive, as we all know, in building the home of football. I know it is set with a lot of controversy, and I think someone wouldn't want his name to rest with something like that. I think if we could do something, in, of course, in his memory, but not nothing that will be chastised and his family will be remembering his name in a poor taste. I don't think he's deserving of that. I would certainly want the powers that be, whoever they may be, that consider naming that facility the Dave and Williams Home of Football to keep his legacy alive. Only time will tell whether such a lofty recognition would be granted to David John Williams, the self-proclaimed football man. Jassy Marik, CNC3 Sports.